Hi everybody, how are you? I think you are fine. I'm Mr. Kabada. This is the second part of uh, basic writing skill, especially for paragraph writing, or one of the quality of paragraph writing, which I intend to focus on what unity in a paragraph is. Unity of your paragraph, or quality of your paragraph, quality of a paragraph, quality of a paragraph, what's quality? The first one is unity. So a paragraph is ways of writing ideas, ways of writing uh, what we feel about uh, or what we feel or what we want to express for writing or what we think to write that paragraph. When is where we think about paragraph, it only deals about one idea. One idea, yeah, that's called paragraph here. So to make a paragraph, meaningful paragraph, we do have some qualities. The first quality is unity. What unity means? Singleness of idea. Singleness of idea, yeah. Singleness of idea means an idea which has one main, one main idea, what is called unity. Unity, a paragraph, one of the qualities of the paragraph is unity. What unity means? It only deals about one idea, which is called singleness of idea, which means that uh, it can be stated or unified or unified paragraph, unified paragraph, unified paragraph begins in a topic sentence, yeah? A topic sentence. Right. Unified paragraph begins in a topic sentence. What's a topic sentence? It is the main content or the main idea of a paragraph. That's called topic sentence here. Or it is the thesis of a topic sentence. The thesis of a paragraph, topic sentence. So to get a unified paragraph, our intention or our focus attention will be the topic sentence. So unified paragraph begins in topic sentence. What does topic sentence mean? It is, as I told you before, it is the main idea of a paragraph here. Look examples, examples, without doubt, loss is beautiful, yeah? Without doubt, loss is beautiful here. Here is called the topic sentence, clear topic sentence here. Topic sentence, which is one of the main ideas of the paragraph that I'm going to state here. In a given topic sentence, we think or we have two things here. One is the title, and the other is the controlling idea. What is the title here? Topic or subject? The topic is LOSA. What about the controlling idea is? Controlling idea. About her beautifulness, yes. Beautifulness. LOSA's beautifulness, yes. Let's take here. What is the title here about LOSA? What is the controlling idea? about Loza's beauty or beautifulness. So here, the controlling idea controls the flow of idea in a paragraph. So uh, on the other hand, the controlling idea keeps, it is unification of or singleness of a paragraph that I'm going to write. That's called unity mean. Unity mean. If and only if. A topic sentence is clearly stated consisting of a subject and controlling idea. There is unification, which means the controlling idea protects the outflow of ideas from the given title. That's called controlling idea here. So here, look here. Without doubt, Loza is beautiful. What makes Loza beautiful? One here. She has long pointed nose. Nose. Attractive posture, attractive posture, and oval face, big eyes, big eyes, comely girl, and, and smart wearing, smart wearing, all these things make Loza beautiful. Look here, beautiful, all these things make Loza beautiful. This flow of ideas show about unity. Unity here. The idea that the topic sentence 
consists a singleness of idea, one idea, that's called unity. So a paragraph has unified, a paragraph has unified, a paragraph has unified me. If you just write something which is different from the listed ideas, a paragraph doesn't keep it is unification. There are some irrelevant ideas which interrupt the flow of idea. So that's not a paragraph. That's not a kind of paragraph, please. So when you say unified, it means it, it, we can get unified paragraph in the introduction or at the topic sentence, and it deals only one content, one idea. That's called unified paragraph. One of, one of the best quality of a paragraph, please. So let me give you a second example here. The second example. Second, what unity in a paragraph mean? What unity in a paragraph means? Look here. Without doubt, without doubt, doubt, Losa is beautiful. He has long point notes. Point and nose and attractive posture. Attractive posture. Her dressing style is her dressing style is smart. She goes to church every day. She has she has a study plan. A study plan. Totally, Loza is a colleague girl. Yeah, Loza is. Look, this is a kind of paragraph, very simple paragraph. Yeah, there is a topic sentence here. Without dust, Loza is beautiful. There is a title and controlling idea. So, the, the way that I'm going to write is about what things make Loza beautiful here. She has one point in us, right? An attractive posture, right? Her dressing style is smart. She goes to church every day. She has a study plan. Totally, Loza is a community. This is a paragraph. This one, there is an irrelevant idea here. There is an irrelevant idea. So you have to just underline state or identify the irrelevant idea. Look here, she goes to church every day, which is an irrelevant. She has a study plan. Look here, these two things doesn't make the paragraph unity. Unity. The para this is not a kind of paragraph. If you avoid or remove these two slides or sentences, the paragraph has unity. So what you want to focus to write a paragraph means things that you want to write. Things that you want to develop the topic sentence depends on the controlling idea. First, what is the topic sentence? Second, what is the controlling idea? If you identify the controlling idea, you simply list it out or pre-store ideas which are related with the controlling idea. So the paragraph has its unification or kept its unification. Otherwise, if you write something which is different from the controlling idea, the paragraph doesn't have unity. So that's not a paragraph, wrong paragraph, wrong ways of writing paragraph. So first and for, for most, you focus on what is the topic sentence and then what is the controlling idea, please. And then you can just write or develop the paragraph, which is called unity. One of the base quality of a paragraph, yeah. One of the base quality of a paragraph. Let me just give you one very short example regarding what unity refers in writing a paragraph. What unity refers in writing a paragraph, please. One is... Uh, 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 the, yeah, this is, or for instance, this is different from, this is different from, different from, a piece of, uh, yeah. What is the title here? This is a topic sentence, it's this is. How this is different from a piece of, what? Yeah. This is the title, the content. How this is different from a piece of, what makes Different dancing from a this hour. One, institution, institution, number of institution, and our number of uh, what's called number of people, number of people, the standard of living, the people's standard of living. What about infrastructure? Infrastructure. What about uh, factory or industry? Industry. What about uh, 
modern hospitals modern hospitals yeah our concern is like this please here how this is different from a disawa an institution there is there is a small institution this but there are large number of institution at this yeah number of people less number of people in this but high number of people in at this what are standard standard of the people standard of living in this is less than that of the people is standard of living in at this hour what about the infrastructure there is a difference what about the industry there is less industry in this but high number of industry in at this hour what about modern hospitals there are few modern hospitals at least one referral hospital in this whereas in this there are a lot of referral hospitals so this thing is make how this is different from a disawa so the paragraph has unity the paragraph has unity you focus on how this is different from a disawa nothing else please nothing else if you just write or insert or add an idea which doesn't show about how this is different from a disawa this is not a kind of paragraph this is it is there is an irrelevant idea here which is different from your paragraph maybe you write an essay or composition so for second again focus on the topic stating the topic sentence to make the paragraph unity second i'm going to i will present the second quality of paragraph what is called coherence of a paragraph i think you will get some key points regarding how you write paragraph that's enough for today thank you very much